Hello, what is going on everyone? Welcome back to Zoni Gaming. Today, I'm going to update every way of farming crystal fast and easy. So yeah, let's get this video started. First of all, when you go to the mission task and when you go clear every daily possible task over here, you will get chance to earn crystal. For instance, here you get 5 crystal, 5, 5, 10, 15. So in the total, you get 40 crystal per day. Next up, when you go to the reward section, you have the battle pass and every time you when you reach a certain amount of PP level, um, after you earn battle points of course, you get the chance to earn crystal. For instance, when you reach level 5, you get 60 crystal. With 10 more level, you gain additionally 60 crystal and so on and so forth. When you go to the event tax, every time a big event happens, you can trade the event materials to the crystal or skins or the frames or materials and so on and so forth. So make sure to do every possible event that is currently happening in the game right now. When you go to the bonus section, every time when you log into the game, you get chance to earn crystal. For instance, at the beginning of the month, I get myself 50 crystal and after a week or so, I get additionally 50 crystal. So that is the first part over here, when you go to the attack section and go to the open world. Um, if you just uh, use all of your attempts to refresh or just refresh until you get the tax you want, you get a chance to earn, earn a crystal tax. For instance, over here I have one crystal tax, um, so just um, make sure to use all of your refresh attempt to get the material or the uh, fragments, Vagri fragments that you are currently farming and then you will get a chance to earn the crystal tax going on to the story um, so for example if you go over here you can see uh, every stage have three tax for you to clear so every time when you clear a tax you get five crystal so in the total we have three tax over here you get 50, 15 crystal after every stage so just do every possible tax that you can and then you will get uh, 15 crystal for every stage that you clear. Um, in the finalization, uh, you get additionally 30 crystal if you clear all the tax that is listed in the all the stage. Uh, same goes with the ex expedition, but the only difference is that uh, there's no finalization reward, there's no extra 30 crystal. Um, but you still get 15 crystal for every time you finish all the tasks that the game requires you to do. Chronicles, same goes with the story stage. Uh, you still have 3 tasks and then you still uh, got um, 15 crystal. But if you go to the challenge mode, you get... Uh, um, 30 crystal because you get uh, 10 crystal reward for every task that you clear and you also get um, 150 crystal if you clear all the tasks listed over here so if you have more stamina to spend why not uh, spend some of your stamina in the chronicles to get all the crystal reward possible and the chronicle and the story will stay there forever so just take your time you don't have to just uh, spend all of your stamina on the story and on, on the chronicles because they will stay here all the time you can spend the uh, stamina on some materials on some other stuff instead um, next up we have the co-op section when I think after the first clear you get crystal reward um, but that's too long ago and cannot remember um, going on to the challenge section is very very important it's basically it's the most effective way uh, to farm crystal is all listed over here. We have the first one this is the abyss and in my case is the super string dimension after I break two uh, reaching level 82. Uh, I'm currently at the level 88 right now and I'm staying in the red lotus and after I get a certain amount of points and fill in the total over here I get 100 crystal and after the finalization award I get additionally 400 more crystal so I get 500 crystal if I do my job right. Um, so what I'm trying to say is that never miss any single abyss and just try your best to go as far as possible for you to get a certain amount of crystal and a suitable amount of crystal for you to farm every week. So uh, just try your best at the abyss. Uh, if you are a casual player, you don't have to worry about it too much. You just um, play and then after you're feeling tired, you just leave it right there. And have to go any further if you're a casual player but if you want to farm waifus your vagri you need to go go your best in the abyss next up we have the memorable arena um, 
Here is the attempt reward. So when you reach a certain attempts, you will get crystal. Um, so in the total, you get 100 crystal if you reach uh, 8 attempts in the memorable arena. So every week, just remember to do the memorable arena even if you are not uh, a competitive player. Just uh, um, go there and just play some attempt and then you will get every possible attempt reward over here. It's a waste of uh, resource and a waste of crystal if you do not uh, try um, at the memorable arena. Next up, we have the Elysian Ram. Oh, this part is very interesting because it works the same, if not a little bit different with the Abyss, but the crystal tax reset every week. So over here, we have the cycle tax. And then um, when you reach a... Uh, Clear, clear the all the difficulty you get crystal and same goes with the first um, with the first time I, I'm sorry um, but uh, every time when you uh, clear the first time you get crystal reward so as you can see over here um, you get 300 and in, in crystal in, to in total um, after you clear all of the first attempt of the Valkyrie so there's a lot of Valkyrie over here of, for you to choose um, but of course, you have to own them first. So just explore every part of the uh, Elysian Ram. When you go to the long, there's an archive and there's a collection reward over here. So uh, if you have uh, Valkyrie, uh, just uh, uh, clear all the possible tags and just uh, gain all the sickness um, to get the crystal reward. So explore every part, possible part, to uh, get to know where to get crystal in the Elysian Ram. This is the part that I forgot to mention in the video. When you go to the Armada and when you go to the Contribution, you get 25 crystal every week. Um, and when you do go to the Dorm section and when you go to the Aaron, if you are lucky enough, you get a crystal uh, Aaron tax. So <laughs> that's basically it. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to leave it in the comment down below. I will gladly give you guys my answer. Peace.